information is truly powerful but it is how you use that information that really gives you the power if the right information were to land in the wrong hands it could lead to disaster and hence we need to protect this information from prying hands and for that purpose we make use of information security practices right so that brings us to the question what is information security for which a very simple answer is it is a set of practices and protocols that help us to secure information before we get started i want to introduce you to great learning academy a free initiative by great learning you can access over 200 plus courses with 1000 plus hours of free content on trending high demand domains absolutely free register now to complete the course and get your free certificate of completion check out the link in the description of the video below if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet I want to request you to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notifications bell so that you don't miss out on any new updates or video releases from Great Learning. If you enjoyed this video, show us some love and like this video. Knowledge increases by sharing, so make sure you share this video with your friends and colleagues. And make sure to comment on the video for any queries or suggestions and I will respond to them. Wherever that information lies, we need to protect it. while it is being transferred from one place to another or whether it's being stored in one place so why is information security so important at all so let's think of it this way if we never had any means of securing information it could lead to disastrous consequences we are dealing with data everywhere and this data is very very valuable and important not just for a company's functioning but also to ensure that the data is not misused Now a lot of times when we are talking about information security a lot of people tend to think about cyber security and because of this there is a lot of confusion between both of them so let's try to clear that out cyber security is all about securing assets that are part of the cyber domain or the internet whereas information security is all about securing information that is part of the cyber domain or the real world In information security we try to secure all the facets of information for example if you had given your personal information to your government for the purpose of registration it would be stored both on their internet servers as well as their physical books and hence it would be important to secure both of those mediums you can think of it like a house that needs a security lock but not just on its front door but on its back door and windows as well because a thief can enter from the window and the back door as well so that's the difference between cyber security and information security so how does information security do all of it let's look at it so there are three main principles confidentiality integrity and availability the so called cia triad confidentiality is all about making sure information is only available to those who have the right authorization and no one else this could mean implementing encryption cryptography or just having tough passwords integrity is all about making sure that data is not tampered with that it remains the same state you left it as and availability is all about making sure that our data is always available to people who are authorized to access it this could mean having backups or it could mean having the right amount of resource pools to support the data to ensure that the ci triad is being implemented organizations make use of something called the information security management which basically tells them how to maintain and manage the ci triad This usually involves identifying risks and then trying to mitigate these risks by identifying important information and assigning a probability of occurrence of threat to it which is basically a hardcore way of saying it that you're ranking a piece of information by how uh, likely it is that a person is going to come and steal it or try to manipulate it now other than the triad there is also a set of information security policies which are basically textbook rules that help guide employees on how they should handle any id assets properly this reduces the number of human errors involved 
But information security is not just about these things. It is more than that. It is about planning. It is about having contingencies. It is about educating people and way more. Talking about the field as a whole, more and more data is being collected these days. And as more and more is being collected, there is more demand for people who have information or have knowledge about information security and hence the rise in number of information security consultants. So the growth of this field is directly proportional to the amount of data we are collecting these days. As more data is being collected, the number of people who need to be hired for this is also rising. So it is a field that is yet to reach its highest potential. And that guys is what information security really is. My name is Ram. Thank you so much for watching. I want to introduce you to Great Learning Academy a free initiative by Great Learning. You can access over 200 plus courses with 1000 plus hours of free content on trending high demand domains. Absolutely free. Register now to complete the course and get your free certificate of completion. Check out the link in the description of the video below. If you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, I want to request you to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notifications bell so that you don't miss out on any new updates or video releases from Great Learning. If you enjoyed this video, show us some love and like this video. Knowledge increases by sharing, so make sure you share this video with your friends and colleagues. And make sure to comment on the video for any queries or suggestions and I will respond to them.